Hey everybody and welcome to another edition of Lane Side Reviews. And on this episode, well, Moe's done it again. He's taken the most revolutionary ball in the last 20 years and made it even better. Here we present the Radical Quick Fix. Alright guys, so welcome back. As always, I'm the Bearded Beast, Rob Johnson, joined once again by Scoops Porter. As we said, we're looking at, well, probably the biggest uh, change in bowling in the last 20 years that well, has changed again in the Radical Quick Fix. So why don't you tell us a little bit about this ball, Scoops? It has the same revolutionary core. Yep. The, sh the shift... Shapeshifter core. Shapeshifter core. That is both symmetric and asymmetric, asymmetric depending yes. on how you drill, drill it. it. Yeah, um, but it's got a brand new cover on it, which actually moves the brake point four to six feet further down the lane. Yep. But it also makes it more continuous than the original, which is just... Yeah. Um, for those of you who threw the original fix, uh, if you were a high track player like myself, you, you saw it reading very, very early, and you usually have to take the surface up on it. Well, this one actually has a better cover on it to give it that distance so us power players and high track players can really get into it. And it takes surface really, really well. One of the things we noticed at the product showcase in Nashville was that even if you change the surface on it, it maintains its motion. It just changes the overall distance before it starts to hook. And to give you an idea, at 2000 grit, it actually outhooks the new Radical Tremendous at its out-of-box surface. But rather than listening to us talk about it, why don't we take it lane side and see how it stacks up. All right, guys, here is Wayne Porter, our speed dominant player. He's bowling a Kegel Main Street oil pattern. Now, as we said, this ball can bonk, be bonk, bonk, bonk. either asymmetric or symmetric. Yes. In this case, we drilled this one asymmetric D um, to see what kind of performance we could get. And uh, Boop. it's kind of good. Yeah. <laughs> what I found too when we threw the, the original is even when you drill the, the asymmetric layouts, you get the continuation yes. down lane of the symmetric. And it's the same thing when we drill it symmetric. We had the benefit of it. A little bit of, a little and, bit of more yeah, yeah, flip. Yeah. So, and this takes it to a whole new level. Yeah, exactly. Um, just that. You can see. Sliding down just a little bit further and boom. boom. Nice hit in power. He's yeah. a little inside his regular line. Yeah. So this is a bit of a stronger ball. Yeah. Um, but it's at it, it's at a really high surface. I think it's uh, 4,000. Yeah. And I think it's like 500, 4,000. 500, 4,000, yeah. And, oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> now, uh, here you are throwing it. Yeah. And, uh, whee! Yeah, you have to stay in, in the in, oil. In the oil, yeah. About because three or four strong. boards, yeah, more than a normal. And yeah. not swinging it way out. Um, not that I can't, which I'm sure... Uh, We've seen in other videos. Yeah. But this one you were able to keep in it and get it to drive, drive through, the through the pins. I wasn't losing any pin carry, and it wasn't skidding. I could still get it to, to turn off the end of the pattern. No flat eights. That. Exactly. No flat eights. <laughs> no blower nines. Yeah, just good Boom. hits. Yeah. Um, just, once again, amazing ball. Leave it to Mo and Phil. You know, we don't actually give Phil enough credit sometimes. We There's the five. About, yeah. Boom. <laughs> we talk about Mo being a rocket scientist. Yeah, yeah. But Phil is a genius himself. Oh, yes. <laughs> we kind of leave him out sometimes, but uh, Phil, we love you. This this ball's ridiculous. Yes. Well, Better than the, ridiculous. It's the quick fix. It's right. But, <laughs> but it, here I am. Like the, like the name said, they decided they were going to quickly fix the complaints about the fix. <laughs> and now you have the quick fix, yep. which is... Now, I too had to keep this one. I played it a little straighter up, yep. um, a little less rev rate in it. Um, 
this one, I put a little more Rev Rate in. And you can see the yeah. versatility. That cover yeah. stock, <coughs> with the original, mm. I, I, I would not be able to f to flatten it out and move out and throw yeah, it straight. Yeah, exactly. With this one, I could kind of play around the lane as much as I wanted to. Um, e and, and like we said, even though it's asymmetric drilling, which yeah. is supposed to have a very short hook window, yeah. this ball is smooth, and man, does it go through the pins. Yeah. <laughs> Boom! Like you just watch it make that turn, yeah, and it sets itself, but it's still got a nice forward roll, and just making sure that you can carry everything in the back row out. Oh yeah, and it didn't overreact when yeah. I put a lot of a lot of hand into it. So yeah. uh, it is the perfect quick fix for those who need it to go longer. All right, guys, that about wraps it up for another show. If you like what you saw this episode and want to find out more, don't forget to follow us on Facebook at Laneside Reviews or click below. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel or click on the box. Or and if you missed our last video or just want to watch it again, you can click on the other box. And don't forget you can pick up any of the jerseys you see in our videos by using this coupon code at LogoInfusion.com. So until next time, guys, we'll see you lane side.